गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल लीव क्लासेस आई एम अंजली आई सी एस सी चिल्ड्रेन यू आर लेफ्ट ओनली विद वन एग्जाम दैट इज योर बायोलॉजी एग्जाम एंड टूडे वी हैव मैम मोनिका विद अस शील बी गिविंग यू द लास्ट मिनट एग्जाम टेस्ट फॉर दिस एग्जाम सो ओवर टू यू मैम होप यू आर डूइंग गुड टूडे आई शेल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द स्ट्रैटी ऑफ सॉल्विंग योर बायो पेपर इट्स अ वेरी स्कोरिंग सब्जेक्ट अमंग ऑल दी साइंस सब्जेक्ट इन दिस पेपर नो नीड of big paragraphs or essay type answers all the answers to be to the point please try to focus on the chapters which are there in your syllabus don't go beyond it try to solve the specimen paper which is there on the official website of your icsc if i talk about your latest syllabus this time three chapters are added which were not there previous year your reproductive system population and pollution they are the elaborative ones and scoring ones also paper is of 80 marks it is divided into section a and section b section a will be having most of the objective questions this year you will get 15 mcqs in section a so while solving those mcqs you have to time yourself one day before exam don't go for mcqs my suggestion is revise your self notes whatever you have prepared throughout the year whatever highlighted terms are there in your book go through it very nicely understand the meaning of those terms and then learn those words these highlighted words will be used in your reasoning based questions your logically reasoning based questions and in the definitions also in section a you will find some other set of questions which will be based on location function based questions and the structure based questions will be asked If you'll get match the column type question, children, please don't do crisscross method. Just write the correct answer in front of the correct word. Focus more and more on the word and meaning of the terms which are highlighted in your book. Like a very small example, difference between chromosome and chromatids. You must be very clear with both the words. In section B, which is of 40 marks, it is little elaborative and descriptive. Here you'll find double decker chapters. like circulatory system nervous system reproductive system there you will also find diagram questions now diagram questions will be of two types so they will ask you to draw the diagram or they will ask you to label the parts of the diagram given now the ones which are complicated ones 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 which are having maximum labelings that 2d or the 3d images of any structure basically they are asked to label and to give the function of the labeled part and the easy ones you can practice for drawing in definitions while writing definitions your key words plays the major role in it in section b you will also find reasoning based questions give reasons for the following so you must be knowing each and every meaning of the term there should be a proper meaning of the term you should be knowing very nicely this time you have genetics also so all the three laws are very important and the definition of all the keywords in the genetics is it's very important you have to understand and then learn absorption by root this is also one of the major topics of plant physiology which needs little more attention now the last minute tips for you all children please follow the only textbook that is prescribed in your school your test book may have stuff perhaps which other textbooks don't have so don't panic don't run after the books council generally do not ask any selective question from one textbook they know how to frame questions so it's better to master your own book rather than running here and there after the books secondly children please do not complicate your concepts go easy keep it simple you know your syllabus you know you must be knowing the boundary of your syllabus don't run after so many youtube channels and your model test papers don't go for high standard of questions of the model test papers maybe sometimes while solving you'll come through those questions which are not there in your textbook so you no need to be panic just know the syllabus and go through the syllabus that's it focus on the syllabus third most point important point children is necessary to freshen up your concepts many students mess up the last examination why because they are over excited as boards exams are going to get over coming to an end children your last paper is like class class 10th paper is like number 10 batsman the last shot is the winning shot and i want each one of you to score that winning shot my best wishes are always with you just give your best best of luck children god bless you thank you so much ma'am and i hope 
my icsc children will definitely follow the instructions the suggestions given by you so all the best to all icsc children god bless you happy learning and stay connected